Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to another episode of Hard Time 4, Modern Day Mod as Germany and X Strikes Back. So we cleaned out our lost enemies in the east and um, yeah, now it's only time for the greatest enemy left, the United States and the final, well, the final holder, the final leader. Actually, there have not been any other leaders. The leader of NATO. Uh, yeah. 40 divisions, that's nothing. Did you lose everything you had in the East? Huh. Maybe. Just maybe. Should we just naval invade the United States? Do we have any kind of navy down here? I don't think so. Where Our navy is... Yeah, everything is right here. And you're basically done for it. No, it's only organization. Something, yeah, right, something is not right here. We Well, tension was at zero, so I fixed that. And now it seems like all the bonuses that I get from tech and stuff is not applied. Because no, none of my units have any supply, the same, or organization, the same with my ships. Modern day mod must have updated and done something. Because this doesn't add up altogether. Uh, so we could go a long way or a short way. Do we have enough political power to actually justify this? Yes, we do. So we're going to go this very short way. And, well, hopefully we won't die, but who knows. I want you 24 divisions to go right here, while you... Well, you're going to... Actually, I can take you one by one. You're going to go very quickly or as quickly as possible right there. And you guys are going to go as quickly as possible right there by land. So uh, these 24 divisions are just going to go for it to the clear nearest port and hopefully not be intercepted by any enemies. They have some fleets down here. Hopefully it won't be too many losses. But yeah, they have to go around this entire way and land in Argentina and then go up to Brazil. Right? There's a border. Yeah, good. And you will be the ones that, well, invade Colombia. And just continues up this entire way. So... Can we do any other justification at the same time? No, it would be... Well, actually, if we had pretty power, we would still... Yeah, that we would earn time on that. We would gain time on that. Sure, 90 days, but waiting 90, 90 became, becomes 180. If we just had pretty power, that would be fine. So, new rule. No more um, national focuses. And come on, really? Hong Kong? Well, I really hope you can just deal with them yourself. I just pull away all my troops. <laughs> Uh, let's see, can we call you... Oh, actually, you all are, are already in the war, so please kill him. Uh, by the way, I can say just I'm sorry for the lack of episodes still. I'm still feeling a bit under it. So, wh where the hell are you going? No, 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 no. no. You are going to go... Well, all these black divisions, you're not going to go around that way. You're going to go right there. Wait, you still say that that's the quickest way? Really? Really? I don't have any allies, no. Then this is completely useless, useless that you're risking yourself going this way. Going under here. Wh what? That can't be cool. Do you have a block right here? No. That got This gotta be short. Maybe it isn't. Alright, well, well, well. We'll see what happens. Uh... Yeah, I haven't been feeling fully. I've just been sleeping the entire day and just relaxing. I feel a bit better now, but um, it's mostly my throat that hurts like hell. I've been drinking tons and tons of tea. I don't even like tea, but it helps the best for the throat. And I've been, well, drugging myself with a different kind of... Uh, not pills, but, you know, throat stuff. <laughs> um, pastilles, I think is correct word. So, um, yeah, I think this will become the last episode of the German campaign. We just have a couple nations we need to bring down. Or, well, one, two, three, I like, let, let's see. Exactly, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven nations that we have just fight against. Okay, that might actually take a while. Hmm, could we somehow get around it? I don't think so. At least seven nations. I was talking about maybe be able to invite one of those nations to our alliance then we wouldn't actually have to well declare war against them here's four more colonies no africa won't help 
Alpine states won't help that either. I don't think there is anything really that we could do. We have to go through each and every one of them. Hmm, too bad. Well, no more natural focus. Let's just gather up with power. We're gaining how much? 1.33 every single day. Good. And let's see, 24, 24, and 10. Everyone is still fine. But the big question is if not. No, you think you will arrive there before these units will actually arrive there. So yeah, it was fast for you. Argentina want to join the war effort? No. None of you are going to join until I say so. Otherwise you might, well, I don't know, go off and do some stupid things. Uh, we are actually missing a ton of chromium right now. Wow. Why are we missing so much? I thought we were doing actually really fine with that just now. Seems like we were not. Um, let's build a bunch right here in, well former Russian territory because we own it and we won't have any resistance right there so let's no 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 Nash focus okay unfulfilled important request yeah that's oh we're simply not getting everything right there uh, non aggression pact resistance insufficient resources low manpower unfulfilled trade and still you again some unit that want to join a garrison division for me I think Delete all that and tell you to join up with, I don't know, these forces. Sure, a bit over the limit, but really? One more? No. Why is, Why are you there? You're not jumping at anyone, so let's remove you. Let's delete all of these. Outdated equipment, transport planes. Yeah, actually, someone said it could be multi-purpose uh, planes. The fighters, basically, that could be acting as transports as well. Um, there should be some kind of like indication of it then, I think. That I could use them for transporting too, but I don't I don't know. Maybe? Or is it attack aircraft that could be no? I have no clue. Maybe it would be fighters, but I'm I'm just gonna stick with the same planes. That I know works as paratrooping. Uh, alright, let's see what else could we pick right now. <laughs> iPhones, Net Warrior. Uh, let's see, soft attack for leg infantry, I'm not that interested. Um, more armor for everyone, sure. Or basically for the mechanized they have my forces. And this is the same, more breakthrough. Why haven't I picked anything right here? I don't know. Uh, let's see, you lost, you lost a tank from someone, somewhere. Sad to see that you're gonna die this way. Well, you are now going around this. Um, we could just say the same and just let you go up right here then instead. That's gonna be well faster. I think yeah, that would probably be faster than going. Yeah, that would be faster. Cool. Uh, resistance occupation. Oh well, just small areas right there. It's not really needed anymore. United States can't really stand against us, especially if they seem to have 41 divisions as this. I thought this would probably update too when everything else updated, but apparently not. You have 40 divisions. This would be a cakewalk, really. Uh, let's see. Maybe we could even shorten that cakewalk. Yeah, I know. I don't want you to do anything. I want you to guard this area, if you can. Because then all we have to do is take down Colombia. Then we can do naval invasions straight into the United States. And then just tell everyone to get there. You have been invading me for far too long. Lost like 10, 10 divisions. So... The AI is doing larger invasions right now, which is good, but they've been losing too many of them. Like here, there are two divisions dying, there are two divisions right there, there are one division right here. Just a constant loss of that can't be sustained forever. Well, the United States should be able to sustain them, but they don't have manpower. They need to raise the ma <laughs> What the hell? Volunteer only? They went to total mobilization and volunteer only? Yeah, you need to raise that manpower, though. otherwise, well, you will just be doomed. Was the loss reset? No, no, the loss have not been reset. Yeah, United States, come on, come on, you need to bump that, otherwise it's not going to be sight exciting. I was really hoping for one really good last episode that's going to be, well, a nail biter, but right now it seems like it will just be a pretty much cakewalk. Uh, let's see, your new... Can I can I add allies? As, no, I can't. So let's just make sure that you are on never repair, good, and you are at fire at will. And where is my fleet right now? Oh, you have arrived already. Wow, that was fast. That was really, really fast. And why am I signing right now and just not when, well, my troops are actually there? If they can't beat the US Navy, then, well, it's, there's no point to it. 
So we just get a sign right there and go in. Uh, let's see. How close are you to actually arriving? We are right there and how cl close until this... Is everything timing up perfectly? Game, I really thank you for this because, well, uh, as I said, I'm not 100% yet. I've been sleeping the entire day, so that really helped me. I think it was I like combi. I don't think I'm super super sick. It was just a combination of getting back to work, sleeping very little, or have completely turned around the time, feeling a bit, just everything at the same time that just took over, and I just really needed sleep, one entire day. <laughs> Again, no, I I can't spare that pretty power right. Now. Actually, I need to. Let's just do it. It's only 17, and if the plans are going as I think right now, then we won't need to go through all these nations. We'll go straight for the United States. You're getting in divisions really quickly though, but, well, you won't be able to withstand the entire, well, force of a unit I'm just gonna throw at you. Because I know eight, at least 9 divisions are right there, and 2 more right there, so you can't have very much in your homeland. Uh, we have ghost divisions. Actually, let's see like this. Oh, too bad I can't do it like this um, so you four divisions you should join here I want to basically have all my tank divisions at least 60 tank divisions 24 20 24 24 pff, that's <laughs> 46 plus 14 yeah okay was that really all yeah cool then we have all our tank divisions at least in America and they should be more than enough to bring it well bring them down Supply will probably be bad right here because of all the tanks. You're taking quite a bit of supply for each and every one, 1 1.7. And you only had, well, 19 right here. Uh, you have quite many troops. Let's see, can I assign any planes right here? I'm pretty sure I should have a couple of planes right now. Yeah, cool, so multi roll. Yeah, let's add 300 right there. And let's add another 200 right here. And let's see, we could add another 100 right here of something. Uh, I don't know. Let's add. Oh, actually, we have Eurofighters. Okay, you will just update as soon as you arrive. Yeah, good. But yeah, you all can't even reach this area. Can you? No. Who is one? Actually, you two could reach. No, only you. That's weird. You all are Eurofighters, right? Eurofighter. You. Oh, you haven't arrived yet. You have arrived yet, but you don't have the range. That this unit have or you might actually have it's just it's way too far away you seem to be focused a bit weirdly like this one is focused right here as this midpoint this one has the midpoint right here and this one has the midpoint right here huh weird but at least 300 fighters right there that should be more than enough come on you split up right there please so we lost two divisions why, why do you want to go right here it's a mountain oh actually it's one of the two provinces we can use oh actually there's a couple more than two provinces but come on you spread around what the hell are you doing tanks okay if you can't well deal with it yourself then I will just tell you you six to go strategically right there because you're gonna arrive there much faster than any other units that is going. There you go. And now let's clear this war. U6 division. Um, okay, yeah, sure, you're called in Colombia. Alright, oh, we need to call in Brazil. Wait, you're not joining the war. But I need you to join this war. <laughs> let's uh, let's <laughs> <laughs> Let's improve relationship a tiny bit. Come on, you need to join this war. Yeah, Brazilian opinion against German Reich. That sh just bumping this should actually help us turning this around. <laughs> oh, there we go. There we go. Joining me there. And now be very aggressive when assaulting and hopefully we should just be able to break them. Yeah, we broke them. Cool. We we did so much damage, we broke the entire front line, so they wouldn't actually have time to... Well, they did not have time to get their second lines from the reserves up to the front. So this would be hopefully a cakewalk. And let's see, how how are you doing, my dear fleet? Are the battleships miss or missile cruisers doing well? I think they are, because I only see victory. Well, I actually don't see any engagements at all. Is my fleet disengaging? No? Now they're fighting. Is this really the big first fight? It might be. 
Or is your fleet trying to escape? No. It's just you can't deal with 27 level 3 missile cruisers. It seems like in modern day mod, just the highest tech stuff is too powerful. Like their, their bombers are most likely doing no Yeah, they're doing absolutely nothing to me. 0 0.01 <laughs> damage, 0 0.02. That's nothing. That's absolutely nothing. So, yeah. Just get the highest tech level stuff in modern day. I think I might actually take a small break from modern day mod just now. I played it quite a bit, and I think people are more interested in Black Ice and uh, Kaiserreich for the moment. So, uh, I think we'll take a short break of this. Oh, modern day campaigns, not Hoi. <laughs> of course. I'm not that crazy. I know, I've tried several other games, you never liked them. I'm gonna stick to Hoi now for. <laughs> Let's see, everything is still going fine. We are barely using. <laughs> We're using half of all the, all the civilian factories we can use. Let's just fix this chromium problem once and for all. There we go. Now we're finally using all the <laughs> all the factories. Uh, let's see. You're going in without any big problems at all. Nope. Just just go in and bring down the capital. That would be that's but that will be enough. So eight days before that's brought down. Good, good, very good. Uh, I think we'll just try to land. Let's see. You still have a very low amount. Yes. Then I think we'll just try to land somewhere right here take port take port and then just go up just bring him down quite quickly i don't think there will be much of a problem since they can't guard they can't even be close to guarding all of their coastline with only 40 soldiers and especially since they have mo well most likely quite few of them right here on the different islands we have seven units we have five units right there like i said here they it was i think 12 so yeah, they can't guard anything close to their entire front line. And there they probably had some more troops. Maybe that was Canadian troops, but they're dead now. So yeah, pretty much a cakewalk. Too bad. But I will actually accept a very easy episode. I wouldn't like to... Well... Over and saying away. Overstress myself. <laughs> a word is completely losing. Yeah, but basically be too too stressed right now that's a nice cool episode so i can actually do one for you you, you got one kind of yesterday and i would at least try to keep two at uh, two today because i'm feeling better but um yeah <laughs> let's see bring this down please come on yes yes go in there because that would probably be it for colombia <laughs> United States and Canada, so we have to bring out Canada too. Well, I'm fine with that. We just need to land right here and everything will be fine. Canada, how are you doing? You have actually more divisions than United States. Good for you, but that's not gonna be enough. As soon wait, really? You're not you're not falling right now? Hello, Colombia. Okay, we need to really just take down pretty much everything. You go to the south, you go to the north. You go in right here, please. You, Yeah, you're killing them right here. We might have to take over this larger city. But let's just try to finish off the rest first. Because that might even be difficult for my tanks to take for. It would take... Well, actually, maybe not. You just go straight for that. You go so for this. And supply right here is fine right now. So my tank should be able to pick up the speed right now. Let's see. We have all the naval tech right Please tell me I do. Oh wait, it's at the top right here. Uh, yes, we have quite a bit of naval tech. But nothing really that decreases the time it takes to do the naval things. Hmm. So it might... Well, it still will still take seven days. But seven days might actually be all I need. I will do seven... They, there are two ports right here. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Can we request any land from you? No, we can't. Too bad. Um, I was thinking... One, two ports, we'll do two units, there and there, seven days later, both of you will land, take Miami, I will send in the rest of the troops, along with you once we have taken, well, some parts right here. Okay, come on, just bring down the capital, or well, their second capital. There we go. Come on, and you go up right here. Some troops might just stay 
Uh, no, actually, that's only Colombian troops. Then they won't. All right, cool. You, since you are pretty much at the correct provinces, are going to be my test subjects of this great and glorious plan. It will succeed, most likely. Or I'm sending you for a doomsday's mission. Doomsday's mission, but I think I think it should be fine. The United States lost most of the divisions in Asia, so I will. Uh, of course, only be stupid if I don't take that as advantage. I shouldn't be that sad over it being, hopefully, a nice episode today uh, without v m any big difficulties. The United States made their stand. They did in Asia. It was a bad move from them. And now they're dead. Wait. No. What the hell happened last episode? Will you X arm? No, oh, shut up, Daniel. Was it was it really that he made you stand there? No, it wasn't. Uh, I'm just looking through the last episode. I don't see very many US divisions now when I'm looking through it. It's mostly China. Divisions from China. Huh. Maybe it wasn't something like that. Well, it was a lot of different nations to the left and right. So there might have been, um, well, a stack of United States troops somewhere. So, okay, maybe not right there, but... Or have you just simply lost... You have lost more divisions from your stupid naval invasions all the time. Well, I managed to withstand them, so I'll take that, that as a win. Alright, how are you doing? You are on your way. Good. Uh, the rest of the tanks, the rest of the 20 divisions, just very quickly rush up right here. <coughs> And prepared to well join up with them uh, the fleet right here you should now go to convoy escort just in case I don't want my tanks to die even though I have all the industry in the entire world I still don't want my tanks to die why throw away divisions un uh, unnecessarily uh, we I don't think we'll ever reach no we won't reach we reach these tanks really really early because I think we took a tech bonus and then reach and then got it with for 50% off but I don't think we will ever well reach the next one let's see where are my tanks right here <laughs> wait you took the same way H how about this plan you took the same way <laughs> what the hell <laughs> let's see US division a garrison division just bring it down is that the one thing that you are going your homeland with you think you thought this entire sea would somehow protect you against me yeah it wouldn't really and now we have nukes, but yeah, we're producing 15.8% <laughs> every single day. Wow. Uh, what, what? Yeah, everyone is now getting there. Please, this is your order. I don't. I'm not gonna make any so far orders. I just want one big order that is bring down the United States and execute it very aggressively. I don't care that it's only two units right here. Actually. Actually, to really make sure that you do what you do... Oh god, it's starting to hurt in my throat now quite a bit. Uh, the honey had a healing power for a while, but now it's... Well, let's see. W there should fall pretty quickly. I will just have to withstand this pain just for you guys. Uh, making myself look like a vic victim. That would probably gain likes and subscribers. Come on. Uh, let's see. Push up right here. The rest of the tanks are coming right now. And I think, actually... It will, it will probably be pretty well timed if I just tell the rest of them to go right here. You have quite a trip to do over the hostile lands right here. Oh, lands. <laughs> the hostile sea. Uh, you're just well, pushing in. Very nice. Bring down these divisions so they can't pretty much well, defend. Rest of the tanks are coming. Actually, you can just be deployed right here. Just take a slightly larger trip. We still have your back, so don't worry. <laughs> Two divisions are breaking, the rest. The US division right here are basically garrison and untrained people. Well, actually, would probably be pretty trained right now. But yeah, they're garrison, they're reserves. They can't withstand the elite forces of Germany that are coming for them. They now finally understood why the entire of Europe well fell. They underestimated us. They're at volunteers only. Yeah, like we don't need that much. We can do. We can deal with them with just volunteers. Just join us in the battle against them, and everything will be fine. Yeah, seems like it won't be fine. You calculated wrong. I'm the one and only supreme power right here, and you should have respected me from the beginning. You should not have. Well, 
forced us down so much in the se first and second world war we should have just accepted that germany is going to take over the world right here uh, yeah thanks modern day way 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 overpowered bye bye but i s yeah i i still really like this game even if it's very easy right here we didn't have it easy at all time no, actually it was quite we, we, we were given enough time to just build up our nation enough. So we are really truly shown Blitzkrieg in this campaign. Modern modern Blitzkrieg. More tanks are coming. Very good. Yes, continue. And let's see. Planes, have you arrived? Yes, you have. But let's see. I think I want a couple of strategic bombers. If that would, well, be fine for you. There we go, strategic bombers, let's assign you to the front front. Let's assign some more fighters, because we have them right there. Let's say another 700 or something. Actually, it's better if I just do like this. Just tell you to, well, go plus a couple hundred. Tell you to go be plus a couple hundred. And the same thing with you. I think you reinforce a bit faster than actually sending more planes right here. Oh, that's too much right now. Um, okay. Never mind, you, we do spawn on red. <laughs> cool. And now we can just assign you right there, you right, actually exit right there, and you right there. And the three bombers, you are already standing by, that's excellent. Then you are gonna join up with a couple of forces, well, a couple of planes right here. You're gonna join them right there. And I need some planes. Can you reach that? Yes, you can. Hello, Washington. No, we don't have enough. Let's see if we can fix that. Uh, let's see, you guys, you're gonna be increased to, well, uh, not maximum, but let's see, 700, and you're gonna transfer right there. Thank you. Let's see, do we have enough superiority right here? Yes, we should have. Washington DC, gone. Philadelphia, gone. New York, gone. Baltimore, gone. And, uh, so, Boston, no, you're not inside area. So, which of these states do we hate, or cities do we hate the most? For me, it matters not at all, but you have steel, which you do not. That almost felt like a rhyme. So, you are gonna dis- Okay, I didn't have range to you, never mind, you're gonna disappear. <laughs> ah. Don't mess with me next time. We lied. Didn't I nuke New York? I must have made a mistake and not selected you for some reason. Okay, let's just make sure that we actually nuke them by sending one more. Right now. There, I see it. And I saw it land. Good. Now I feel comfortable of you being nuked. Uh, let's see. how. What did that do against your natural unity? Yeah, quite a bit. You shouldn't be able to hold out for much, much longer. Green divisions, you have pretty much arrived. Your order is gonna be the same as my other unit. Take everything, and the same thing with you, blue. Take everything. Leave none, non-German. <laughs> so yeah, please just push up, take everything. Houston, we have a problem. Germans are coming. Win not, th not this time it's not winter, it's the Germans. Uh, let's see, why, are, why don't we have anything right here? Are you not doing your missions or something? Oh no, you're not. There we go. Now we do missions everywhere. Houston, we have a problem. Nuke is coming. Nuke is coming. Nuke, nuke is coming. Nuke is gone. Boom. Holy crap, that should have made a chain reaction with all that oil you have right there. Dallas, yeah, you're probably next if I even have time for that. Because once we start to take these larger cities, the United States will fall very, very quickly. They have lost way too many troops. Wait, is that... It might just have been. I said Modern Day mod updated. What if it was something that gave you as an event that switched it volunteers only? Because this does not make sense. One million dead, and well, 40 more division, 80, 80 divisions right now. So you are deploying a bit more, but unfortunately you can't stand against 60 of my divisions. Actually, only 59, I think. Yeah, you lost one. Bastard. And now we have Brazil that actually <laughs> came in and invaded and took Houston from me. 
Uh, let's see, Dallas, Dallas, bye bye. US, you shouldn't use nukes on, nukes on people if you're not sure they can't nuke you back. And well, I couldn't. Now I can. Let's just send you one more right there, just in case. And please go in and ga grab Dallas now. And do not let, well, Brazil steal one more for, from us. God. Come on, come on, quickly now. My pain is. My, <laughs> my throat is killing me right now. Holy crap, you probably heard that. <laughs> my brother is watching with a friend some football. <laughs> Uh, let's see, Washington DC is mine, and that should be it, come on, there we go, US gone, United States are capitulated, and now, the black divisions right here, bring down Canada, the green divisions right there, bring down Canada, and then we have the blue divisions right there, bring down Canada, and split in, actually no, now, split in half, Assigned right there and bring down Canada and everyone execute their new orders as quickly as possible uh, Before that actually happens. I don't care that actually you US holds a couple of small provinces right here uh, What I plan to do is first of all just switch everyone right here Assigned right here. No right there apparently and here Canada your capital Hopefully you won't feel like you need it. Well, it's not there anymore. And you will still lose 14 nationality once you nuke you one more time. Awesome. And that should be pretty much Canada. Or, actually, you had a ton of. Wow. You had a bunch of nationality. Well, let's go in and grab the two biggest cities you have, I think. Or I might be wrong in my Canadian city sizes, most likely. Um, okay, Montreal is ours. Now, please go in and grab Toronto too. Come on, just, just go in there. Thanks. In with you. Thank you. Though I wonder if the local population would be able to resist us pretty goddamn well. Actually, Vancouver might be pretty goddamn big. Uh, let's actually check what state sites. 4.8 million. This was 6 million. And this was 12 million. So, no, I might have actually been correct in sizes. And <laughs> it never occurred to me. I just look at the states which one is bigger. <laughs> Actually, I was correct. Cool. Uh, let's see. You are bringing down everything right there. You are going in. You are going in. Everyone's just walking in right now. And this was exactly the, a perfect episode. And there we go. Canada is gone. Japan actually has quite a bit of a score. Belgium. Thank you. No change government. US. Well. Take all states. Well, I can't apparently do that. Uh, let's just grab everything we can take first then. And then we can go for the other things. England. <laughs> Not United Kingdom. England. Okay, we can't take everything right there. Let's just continue. There was Greece. Netherlands. Canada maybe? Nope. Luxembourg, definitely. Portugal. Nope. Okay, let's just end it right there then. And pass. Pass again. And now focus on the large ones. Uh, I wonder if you t if anyone else have taken any land. Well, uh, first of all, let's bring down France. That's one very important revenge in the Axis Strikes Back. Taking all of France and United Kingdom. That was also pretty goddamn important. So at least we're taking a very important stuff. Zero. To take it. Wow. Such an insult. Let's see, Poland needs is also pretty goddamn important that I actually grab. Kaliningrad seems to have been liberated by someone. There you go, everything right there is mine. Let's see, who else? I think it's just actually time to begin right here. Let's take down all of Canada. That shouldn't cost me that much points. Mostly it's open ground and nothing, nothing super important. Actually, we can't grab all of Canada. Pretty much all of Canada, but not all of it. There we go. I pretty much got all the points that are left right now. It seems like the US will be mostly taken to me, but I wonder who took this. Was it Spain, maybe? Might have been. Oh, let's just go in right here. This will probably go faster. I just want to see the world now being German. There we go. 
everything right there is mine and let's just pop down Canada Canada is gone no it isn't so why weird uh, Portugal thank you thank you for your service Bulgaria Lithuania Hong Kong okay uh, take all states one state and Colombia Colum oh you're right Colombia <laughs> I was like I don't remember attacking them oh wait I just attacked them and you seem to still have one left Guantanamo Bay and Lithuania take memo and there you go let's see how the new world order well looks like come on there we go we're not war with anyone no that was just old so we got German Reich we got a lot of people that was liberated that are under me what did I accidentally make a bunch of puppets? <laughs> oh, that's at least a yeah, puppet of Japan, but I must have accidentally made a bunch of puppets. <laughs> well, I, actually, I'm kind of fine with that. I'm kind of fine with that. And what the hell was this? You're not under me or anything, but... Something really weird happened right here. I think someone else might have received a peace conference again after us. And stuff happened but anyway the most important stuff is right here we took all right we took over everything right here that should rightfully be ours and we now have a well real new world power the Berlin Alliance I hope you guys enjoyed this campaign oh actually I should be a lot oh, crap I should have been a large race game but I don't feel that well so I didn't want to yeah I hope you enjoyed this campaign that you like and subscribe oh wait people have been asking about why I was orange I am um, that was just a program I actually explained that larger, last time in another episode. Whatever. People have also, also been asking about my hair. I was going to color it a tiny bit. It took a bit too much. Whoops. Anyway, now. <laughs> thank you for joining me for this episode. Or for this ca entire campaign. I hope you liked it. That you comment. That you subscribe. And I will, that I will see you guys next time. God, I have a problem speaking. And I'm sick. I'm not feeling great. <laughs> bye. And bye.